I'm gonna show you how these homemade clip indicators, you know, how they work. I made them, I'm selling these two right here. Have my oscilloscope ready. I have it already you know, set with a 40 test, 40 hertz test tone. Here's where they're connected. It's left and right, both front channels. So I have 11 and putting it up. That's 14, 15, 16. It starts clipping at 16 and it, it's starting to make a buzz, buzzing noise. If I turn it up more, it becomes a little louder and louder. Now that's a 40 te hertz test. I'm gonna show the thousand hertz test tone or kilohertz. I'm gonna turn it on. There's a generator. There's now here you can you can hear it because it's some of it is passing through. The, some of that noise is passing through the tweeter. It's 18, 19. 20, 21, it's out, it starts to distort there, and you can hear it. Now that's hard, that's a hard clip right there at 22. Overall, these are pretty inexpensive to make. You can you can pick these up, these, these were actually spared from a Honda. Uh, you could use any tweeter. I pulled the ones that I had on a Honda. I really bought the sales for my Honda since I was gonna butcher them. Being, I was putting in aftermarket uh, tweeters. So it had these came in, they're kind of like a freebie. So it is what it is. All you need is a, a tweeter. A lot of people use Piazza tweeters. You can use that, and, but they don't put a capacitor. The, the trick is to put a capacitor either. You put a 3.3 a or a, let's see here, a 2.2 microfarad capacitor. A hundred volts would, should be fine. I mean, yeah, you can go a little uh, higher on the voltage if you'd like. Uh, it doesn't, it, it's not, it doesn't help uh, with, for the most part, if you have like a two, maybe a 2000 watt app RMS, you could still use it. I've used it on mine, on my Wolframs. So go ahead. But if you have uh, something way more than that, even a 2000 watt amp, you should really get an oscilloscope. This is a cheap one. Yeah, this is the DSO-138, they're cheap. Um, you can pick it up, but you have to spend a little more on the probe uh, so that it works on the amplifiers. You can, you, you can check uh, the low uh, voltage, like for instance, coming out straight out the head unit. But if you want to check high voltage, then you need one of these times 10 probes. Uh, hope this video helps this these you can pick these up at, at on eBay I think the blue ones I picked them up on eBay, but the which are the 2.2 the 3.3s I picked up on Parts Express I usually wait until I have a big enough order so it's free shipping you can go ahead and do that uh, just, I hope it again hope it helps um, See you guys next time